Hi, I'm Pasta Chuck from the Pasta Chuck YouTube website. Thanks for joining me as we go exploring. Today we're exploring Olive Garden's never ending pasta pass offer and giving you some tips that you can use to increase your odds of scoring a pasta pass. Olive Garden offers an eight week pasta pass that costs $100 plus tax. This pasta pass entitles you to eat as much food as you can off the pasta pass menu in as many Olive Gardens around the United States for over eight weeks. And in my case, I have one of the 1,000 pasta passes that is 52 weeks long. 52 weeks! I can eat 52 weeks of never ending pasta in any Olive Garden across the United States. My pass costs $300 plus tax this year. I have a family of four, and this year all four of my family members scored a pasta pass. That's four for four in my family. We ended up with three eight-week pasta passes and one 52-week pasta pass in one family. Going back two years, my family of four had three pasta passes. I have a lot of people ask me, Pasta Chuck, how does your family keep scoring so many never-ending pasta passes? I would usually tell everyone that my family is just lucky. I'm lucky, my family is lucky. But is there something else besides luck? Let's go over some tips. Log on to the designated Olive Garden website prior to your pasta pass sale. If you log in early, this will help you identify any problems you might have prior to the pasta pass sale. And it also gives you more time to fix those problems. In the past, Olive Garden has given you a countdown timer leading up to the sale of the pasta passes. So you have to be ready. As Olive Garden heads into the countdown timer, go into lockdown mode. What do I mean by lockdown mode? Here, let me give you some examples. Don't leave your computer. Don't go get a cup of coffee. Don't answer the front door and don't answer your phone. You need to stay focused on whatever device you're using to score a pasta pass during the countdown. Use more than one computer. Have a good internet connection. If you have a notoriously poor internet connection, make alternate arrangements. Open more than one tab on your computer and in each tab, log on to all the garden. Try using a different browser for each tab that you open. With multiple tabs open, you are logged into the Olive Garden web website. You do not, if you do not score a pasta pass the first time, click on the second tab and try again. I have to ask you, do you have any friends or relatives who do, do not want a never ending pasta pass? Neither do I. But if you can find such a person, recruit them have them log on to the website and use them to start clicking for your pasta pass. You must have your credit card ready. If you don't have your credit card ready, when you're in the queue and you've scored a, a pasta pass, you're going to lose the pasta pass when you time out. So you have your payment ready. You know, my daughter Georgiana scored three pasta passes in one year using only one computer that was open to multiple tabs. So yes, it can be done. How many pasta passes have you had? If you never scored a pasta pass, how many years have you been trying? How fast can you click your mouse? When you're in the countdown timer and it hits zero, you need to start clicking for that pasta pass. I'm going to give you a pasta pass tip. You can practice your tipping on your mouse, clicking it, and uh, why don't you click on subscribe to Pasta Chuck's channel, click and hit like, and leave a comment. Don't forget to ring the bell and you can get new notifications of my videos. I'm Pasta Chuck and I'm wishing you luck in your quest for the never ending pasta pass.